we wanted him to give the summary. What does he do and how did they come here? Firstly, they must introduce, he's going to introduce himself, the name and the surname, but they will introduce themselves. They come from the same place <clears throat> and then she will start. My name is Shengiwe Muletani and I'm from Muletani Secondary School. I gave it my all, I gave it my level best. I saw first what the importance of, of the GDN was and then how South Africa and Australia can work more cooperatively would help each other and then the importance of G20 how can it contribute to both countries. I wrote the essay with the knowledge and then with the information that I got. My friends were supporting me when I was about to get the results of the G20 like I thought that I didn't make it. And then I managed to go to the top 10. The top 3 I, I, I also thought that I wasn't going to make it. So I believe in myself now. When I was told that I was going to meet the president, I was a bit nervous <laughs> meeting him for the first time. At the same time, I was ecstatic. I was over the moon. I couldn't control my emotions. So, And then the one promise that I'm going to promise him is that I'm going to aim for more opportunities, grab each and every star that I come across, and then make use of it. The flight was a very long one, but when I landed here, all the tiredness and the exhaustion was just faded away when I saw the beauty of the city. So it was just great and awesome. <laughs> I'm Vanessa Mahasha from Muletani. I was very passionate on writing the essay because my educator did introduce this topic in the assembly. Then I told my friends that, wow, I want to, to get into this competition. I saw that this is an opportunity of a lifetime. Then I entered the competition. Then they chose the top 10. Then my educator told me that I, I managed to go to the top 10. Then we were interviewed by him. Then they chose the top three. That's how I got it. <laughs> well, thank you very much indeed. And, and I'm happy. I'm happy, firstly, my brother. The initiative you are undertaking, I think, is absolutely wonderful. At least if you have two or three coming, and exposed to the world, it takes them many steps forward because they get to know the world. Just traveling in itself is an education. In your life, aim high. Don't aim down there so that you can move forward. I'm, I'm very happy that you, you are here. For an example, I'm meeting you now. This now calls me to visit Mlesan because I want to see this school. You see? to come and see what he says is happening. Yes. And to see also the school, the vibe, <laughs> so to speak. You are doing grade what? 11. Grade 11? Grade 10. But you debate with grade, with <laughs> matrix, with grade 12. <laughs> There's a leader here, <laughs> a leader, absolutely. And, and, and you win. Yeah. It is the hard workers, the outgoer finding that succeed. Mm. Those who are lazy, they normally don't succeed. So hardworking is what we need. I'm, I'm very impressed to have met this young, two young ladies and the gentlemen who are so committed to help young people develop them into tomorrow's entrepreneurs, professionals.